Hey everybody, um, man, what a week this has been. Um, I planned like three videos to happen, but I wasn't able to film any of them. A uh, bunch of craziness happened. Uh, don't worry about this. I just don't want my company's logo visible while I'm doing this video. Um, man, uh, where to start? So, last Friday, I get a call from my mom's uh, physical therapy. Uh, she has a thing with her legs. She does the physical therapy. Uh, they called me to tell me that they're sending her to the ER. So... Obviously, I'm like, well, is everything okay? Uh, she had difficulty breathing. And um, so they sent her to the ER. Uh, the ER called me. Um, I'm going to tell the story, but just know in advance that what they told me might be happening did not happen. Okay? So they told me that um, they were having difficulties finding a vein do some IV for some treatment and if they can't find the, the vein they'll probably have to do a, uh, a breathing tube which they didn't have to do uh, thank God um, she ended up having an infection that she didn't even know about and that's what triggered everything so she was in the um, hospital actually until last night so it's just been a crazy week with me and Luke. I, I had to make arrangements for people to uh, drop him off to school and whatnot. So she, um, but she's home. She's okay now. Um, yesterday, I thought it was weird that my one cat, Olivia, um, the one day, I mean, I could, I'm, I'm uploading this from my phone, so I'm not going to be able to put pictures in. But um, she's the one that, like, when I get home, she'll just lay right on me. And I thought it was weird that she didn't greet me in the morning. And then I started thinking about that I didn't get her coming in at night. But I'm like, well, my room's got a tin roof, so maybe she, it's just scaring her because of the sound of the rain. Because it was a pretty bad thunderstorm. And um, so I'm like, well, I didn't really think much of it. You know, got Luke out the door. And then had to pick Luke or pick my mother up last night. And when I got home with my mom, cat was outside. Um, I had popped the door open to see what the weather was doing, and I have a feeling she's snuck out. She doesn't. She's not the one that'll usually sneak out, which is what threw me off. But uh, which is why I didn't even think. Oh, she's outside. Um, so I try various things on. You know, last night to get her in the house, um, she was hiding underneath our trailer, the, the house we live in. And um, so I tried various things to coerce her out. She'd come out, but she was, she, you could see in her face she was scared because we live in the woods. There's lots of scary stuff for cats. <laughs> um, so my cousin then message me she's a very we'll just say petite person she's very tiny she says hey I'll come tomorrow morning if you haven't seen you know got her in yet and um, and uh, go under your trailer and get her out I'm like oh okay if you don't mind you know um so she so she tells me she's on her way and I'm basing you know from you know where she lives to where I live I'm like okay just you know this particular time should be right about when she's showing up so I go and uh go outside and when I go outside she's underneath the she's underneath the um raised planters that you guys have seen in other videos which I actually need to do an update video on um things are going great and not so great with that <laughs> but um so I go out I, I see her out there so I start going hey uh, so I started you know, going Olivia Olivia and um, she goes under the trailer and then looks at me she's looking at me like hey I want to jump to you so I ended up um, 
I ended up uh, sitting on the ground. I was wearing my favorite clothes to lounge around the house in. Uh, by the way, all this is going on while I'm supposed to be at work. Just so you know. <laughs> so, I'm supposed to be at work at this point. <laughs> um, so I sit, da sit down and you know, I'm like, you know, tapping my leg. Hey, Olivia, come here. You know, I'm doing it real soft, real, real nice. And then um, she, she then goes, um, starts to come out and she comes up to me. So I, you know, grab her and I take her inside. And um, my mom sent me some pictures throughout the day that she's doing okay. But so I go to call my cousin to be like, hey, um, I got her. <laughs> And so, you know, I'm outside, or I had already gone back outside at that point when I decided to call her. Um, where my router is, um, I had to use Wi-Fi calling on my phone because nobody knows that the uh, neighborhood I live in exists as far as phone companies go. <laughs> so I go in, or I, I go around front, and there she is uh, out there. So I'm like, hey, by the way, I got her. She's like, well, you know, I'm still glad you got her. You know, don't worry. Because I was like, you want gas money or anything? She was like, no, 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 don't worry about it. So that was nice. But um, it's like, what a crazy week this has been. Um, being that this is only six minutes into the video, um, I really don't work far from here. <laughs> but yeah, so that's, that's where I've been. <laughs> You know, my mother, like I said, she's doing, she's basically back to normal, you know, no, uh, no infection, no, you know, she's feeling good, she's walking around just fine, but, um, yeah, it was just like, yeah, because we, um, but on the plus side, uh, there's a place near me, um, <sighs> it's a couple towns over. So, being that it's a couple towns over, I'm not going to worry too much about saying who it is. But it's, uh, they call it Ray's Pizza and Tacos. And um, I've been getting their cheesesteaks and I've been getting their uh, their tacos. And I said, you know what? My mom said something about she'd like some pizza. I said, well, you know, this other place, you know, their pizza is okay. You know, the place where we normally go. I mean, it's still good, but there's a place in... Woodstown, New Jersey called Joe's Pizza and that is to us the gold standard. You know, everything else is like, okay, well, Teeny Hut is here, uh, Car Carollo's is here, you know. So, I, um, I said, well, let's try the pizza from Ray's Pizza. I mean, they do, they do have pizza in the name. <laughs> so, okay. So, we ended up getting that delivered and I have to put this into perspective. Um, there's this place called Carollo's in Franklinville that has pretty good pizza. I mean, like, it's... It's probably in my top five. But... I got two large pizzas one day. Um, one plain with extra cheese. A plain... Or not plain. A sausage with extra cheese. And a two liter soda, it was almost 60 bucks. And I'm like, you know, what the Franklin here, you know? And so, like, we, we just kind of stopped going there because it's, it's kind of expensive. The other place, uh, two large pizzas like that is usually about 40 bucks. And uh, I get the stuff from Ray's, and it was phenomenal pizza. I mean, like I said before, you know, Joe's is here. They're, they're like just about overlapping. You know, like Joe's is here, they're here. Okay, like they're, like this was a darn good pizza. And before tax and tip, it was $37. Um, I'm like, really? Okay. So I found a place that's got fantastic pizza and it's cheaper. <laughs> or better pizza and it's cheaper. Can't go wrong with that, right? So I now have a, a favorite pizza place in my in, in the area where I live. None of this is relevant to the week, but you know, it's just 
you know, it's just been, been a very long week. And, like, I know this might not be relevant to many people, but if, if you're wondering where I've been, um, I've just been very busy because, you know, um, you know, my mom's in the hospital. So between taking care of stuff with her, taking care of Luke, um, taking care of myself, you know, working 40 hours, you know, it's just been a, been a rough week. But everything's uh, everything's good. Um, I don't know if I'll get anything filmed this afternoon or I mean this weekend. Um, the video that I put up the other day um, of diagnosing the uh, that fuel shot off, like man, I I knew that video wasn't going to do well, but I was not prepared for just how unwell <laughs> that was going to do. Um, it's one of ones that, that once it hits a certain point in the search um, relevance, it's it's just going to uh, like like constantly like one to two views a week, one to two views a week. You know, it like it'll it'll do well over time. And I, like I, I knew that going into it, but man, I was not prepared for. <laughs> Or I think it's still sitting at like 13 views right now and it's been a week and that was actually done the day she went to the hospital oh the day she went to the hospital um so I call or well, the, the hospital calls me tells me that and they said they'll call me back you know by five o'clock I said okay well I didn't realize that okay well now it's almost six o'clock haven't heard from them so I go to call them. We'll call you back in about 15 minutes. Okay. I'll, so another hour goes by. We'll call you. Um, no, I think that was just, just about 7 o'clock at this point. And they're like, well, it's a shift change. It'll probably take an hour or so. Um, the hospital has a rule. I don't know if this is a thing with all hospitals. Um, so if, if it is, I'm sorry. I, I don't know that. But um, they don't allow anybody under the age of 12 to visit patients. And, well, you know, Luke's seven. So, math. And uh, so my neighbor's like, look, man, just go to the hospital. Tell them you want to know what's going on. I'll watch Luke. He's a neighbor I trust. and Because him and his daughter were outside. So I'm like, all right, if you're okay with this, I'm going to run up there. So I ran over there, you know, got what was going on. And then I felt better. But... I, it's just, I feel like I shouldn't have to go there just to find out what's going on with my mother, you know, especially since she's there. So I meant to say that earlier in the video, but I forgot. <laughs> um, but I'm going to stop rambling. It's been 13 minutes and uh, you can probably tell just how tired that I am. And I got to run, I got to run sound at church tonight. So that's going to be fun being this tired. So. Thank you guys for watching. Have a blessed day. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe.